Aho! This is a member of the Voice of Reason coming at you. And it, occurred, it just occurred to me that I never showed any of my subscribers my camper. Um, I am now. I just now missed the bus to make it out to my camper before it gets dark. So I'm gonna have to find somewhere to plug my laptop and my phone in to get my battery charged. My batteries charge a little bit more. Then I'm gonna have to pull some money and pay for a cab I can't afford. But hey, that that's come to the territory. So. Um, I am, plus steps I do as I get, you know, ride with the service, one way. Anyway, I'm going to get a ride out to the camper, and I'm going to sleep there. And when you hear from me next, I am going to, I'm going to, it's going to be the following morning, and I'm going to show you the inside of a sitting bowl. In fact, you know, as soon as I, use my first thing in the, during the daytime, I'm going to be officially brand, I'm putting, um, Putting the letters on Sitting Bull and labeling her once and labeling him once and for all. My trailer is a boy, not a girl. So he, he'll, I, I'll, if he, he'll take, I'll take care of him, and he will take care of me. Speaking of taking care of, I just got myself a new fuel pump, so I can hook my propane tank, propane tanks into it, so I can start cooking in it. Anyway, um, this is a member of the voice of reason, and um, like I said. I'm now going to sit there and show you my camper in person. Ha <laughs> ha Aho. This is a member of the Voice of Reason. I'm coming at you. And I'm inside the sitting bowl today. <laughs> like I told you, I told I, I told you my next broadcast would be from inside here. Um, I was sitting in front of the Trailways bus station in New Paltz, and now I'm sitting here. Um, this is my first time actually broadcasting to you, coming at you from inside Sitting Bowl. Since um, so I'm, I've only sent you pictures of it, but now I'm physically actually inside my camper. This thing is awesome. Um, it's kind of a mess right now because I put a bunch of shit in here. It's going to take me quite a while to organize it. As you can see, I have a bunch of laundry on, sitting on the bed. Um, mountain laundry, i got to do all that stuff. Um, so, let me give you the grand tour. <laughs> okay. Um, right here, I have my bathroom area. And the red bucket is for gray water. And the white bucket is for fresh wash water. Um, I don't have the money to fix the um, to fix the shower system. I don't care. I'd rather just wash with these anyway. This is an oil pan. However, I pour this is an oil pan. However, what I do is I pour the water in there, and then I just scrub up with it from there. That's where I keep my hygiene stuff. Once I have this organized, the bed's gonna be nice and made, and 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 um and it's gonna look wonderful. Um, as you see, I have the windshield covers for the windows for the winter time. Um. I guess I'm still organizing my Red Bull fridge that's going to the powwow. This whole thing is going to be going to the powwow. Here's my kitchen area. This is where the pit, this is where the table system used to be, but the, the other owner took it out, and it leaves, it leaves up a ton a ton of more space. So when I have this all organized, the Red Bull is going to be sitting right, right, right in this area. So this thing is really cool, you know. Um, this is this is going to be my home. And oh, the propane tanks are at my feet. Hello. There's my pantry. <laughs> yep. I already saw me in. There's my kitchenware. Uh, it's all the glasses and stuff. Wow. I put a lot of stuff in these cabinets. Ah, my deep fried griddle. That thing is awesome. And there's my fridge. I don't think I'll be using that anytime soon. There's the oven. And there's the stove. This thing works out there. And as you see, I have the propane tanks, tanks at my feet. So yeah, this thing is neat. And this couch right here pulls out into a futon. So this thing could actually fit three to four people on it um, once it's fully sprawled out. <clears throat> I slept here last night. It was pitch black. I actually had to turn the, the laptop here. was the only real light I had. Um... It's been quite an experience so far, the journey I've taken acquiring this. Um, 
after sleeping in this thing for the first time last night, I could tell you this much. Um, I don't want to sleep. I don't want to. I don't want to. I like. I like sleeping in this way too much to go back to sleeping in an ordinary apartment. This is my home. I like it. And I'm not going back to live to, to living in a house. This is this is I mean I this is this is a home. This is a house. It just happens to be a camper house. And there's nothing wrong with it. You know I'm trying to acquire a truck so I can pull this around and you know do some traveling. I have the freedom of going. Um, this is very liberating and freeing, and I feel great. I'm rested. I slept. You know I'm gonna have you know I have to tip to my way out of here, and I have stickers. Label stickers, um, courtesy of True Value, True Value Hardware. Um, I also got the fuel pump for the propane tanks at True Value. I got the bug, I got the oil pan at Agway, and um, that I mean that that actually that thing actually is for like for for horses. That thing right there, that that black thing. But um, yeah, there's a lot of basic resources. I want to refuel my propane tanks. So I can go to Agway. There's a lot of useful. I mean, I mean, there's there, um, there's true values in Agways all, all Agways all over the country, um, and um, there's a viable there, that is a viable resource to read um, to um, to refill everything. Um, if you can't, if there's not a campers world near near you, you know, it's either way it works. You know, um, yeah, you can do this too. Man, today I used up. 200% less natural resources than a person who lives in an ordinary house. I use maybe half a gallon of water and and taking taking my shower today. Yeah, and now and I'm just and I'm clean. I feel great on that one that part. Just as clean as everybody else. I just didn't. I just use a lot less water to get clean. And you know I like that. Um. I'm looking forward to the powwow. It's gonna be exhausting. I'm gonna to have to pay for a U-Haul. That, that that's gonna suck. It, I feel a lot better. Um, to the haters and people who don't like me, I'm not sure. I, I mean, hey, you know, you can't stop me. You can't get in the way of me being happy. So what am I going to do? I'm going to take these and I'm going to put them on the door. And I'm fi finally going to give Sitting Bull, which is what I'm naming the camper. This is Sitting Bull. The world meet Sitting, um, meet sitting Bull. Sitting Bull meet the world. <laughs> um, now that you two have become acquainted, um, I hope, hope to bring you many, many other videos from inside and outside of Sitting Bull. Um, to my, to all my beloved fans and subscribers, I love you all. I hope you, I wish you, I hope you, um, I hope you show a lot of love and do me the favor of subscribing and having more people subscribe if you like this video and click on the little fire bell looking thingy, uh, um, ram, ram, rip, ram, rip below the bottom of the screen. Cause I know very well you want to, I, I know very well you want to do that. And, um, Hey, sharing is caring, man. Share the love and please, please subscribe because I can't bring more videos to you like this or I can't bring you more interesting videos like this unless I reach at least two to 3,000 subscribers. So help me help me reach that goal. Um, I know it sounds weird and like cliche like other YouTubers have, but yeah, believe it or not, this is, you know, it's options are limited on these days. Um, oh, yeah. I, hope, I mean, and... I didn't get a chance to go over everything that was in the camper, but yeah, this is this is it. This is setting bolt. Fixer upper, but hey, it's a piece of shit, but it's my piece of shit. And when you enter this lifestyle, your first one is gonna be a piece of shit, because you're learning the ropes. Um by the time I sell this, I hope to sell it to another pow pow or a Native Amer Native American who could use it. That way they can it could be it could stay within the circle and the confines um yeah, of other people. That's why I'm gonna name it sitting bull. And to give up sitting bull to somebody else, I'd rather have somebody buy it off me. Who knows who, who would want to make good use of it. Um, this is a member of the voice of reason. 
Aho. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, uh, I'll see you around.